Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'll show you how to design a demultiplexer using the SimulID software. So let's open the SimulID. Now as you can see, we have already designed a 1 is to 4 demultiplexer. So it has one input and four outputs y0 y1 y2 and y3 and there are two select lines s0 and s1 and there is one more input enable now the ic7404 is used to complement the inputs s0 and s1 so that both are available in complemented and uncomplemented forms now as far as the working is concerned when the select line is at 0 0 when both the select lines are connected to ground or 0 volt then the first AND gate will be active provided that the enable signal is high and then depending on your input if it is 0 the output Y0 is 0 and if it is 1 output Y0 will be 1. So basically with the help of these two select lines S0 and S1 we select one of these four output lines Y0 to Y3. So with the combination 0 0 Y0 is active with the combination 0 1 Y1 is active with the combination 1 0 Y2 and with combination 1 1 at the select line Y3 output will be active and whatever data is available on the input pin will be transferred to the active output while all the remaining outputs will remain zero or will reflect the appropriate data so let's start with the simulation now as you can see the inputs s0 and s1 both are zero and thus y0 is active but still we have not connected the enable to 1 even if you change the input no change in the output can be seen and after making the enable input high then and then only the output will change as per the input so now you can see y0 is 1 because the input is connected to VCC or high when the input is 0 the output y0 will remain 0 now with S1 0 and S0 1, Y1 gets selected. So right now we have 0 at the input and the LED is off. The moment you make input 1, the Y1 LED turns on. Next with S1 1 and S0 0, you get Y2 selected and because the input is connected to logic high, the output LED turns on. If you connect it to 0, the output goes to 0. And with both the select lines connected to VCC, the Y3 output is active and the input data will be reflected at the output Y3. So this is how we can design a 1 is to 4 multiplexer with the help of basic gates and the SimulID simulator. Thank you. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe, like and feel free to share it with your friends. Thank you.